Hello and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss a question which says prove that opposite sides of a quadrilateral circumscribing a circle subtend supplementary angles at the center of the circle. Now we know that the lengths of tangents drawn from an external point to a circle are equal. So let's start the solution. Now we are given a circle with center O touches the sides A, B, B, C, C, D and D, A of a quadrilateral A, B, C, D at P, Q, R and S respectively. Now, side AB of a quadrilateral ABCD subtend angle AOB at the center and its opposite side CD subtend angle COD at the center. So we have to prove angle AOB plus angle COD is equal to 180 degree because we have to prove that the opposite sides of a quadrilateral circumscribing a circle subtends supplementary angles at the center of the circle. Similarly, side AD subtends angle AOD at the center and its opposite side BC subtends angle BOC at the center. So also we have to prove angle AOD plus angle BOC is equal to 180 degree. Construction Join OP, OQ, OR and OS. Proof In triangle AOS and triangle AOP we have OS is equal to OP radii of the same circle OA is equal to OA common. Again, AS is equal to AP because lengths of tangent drawn 
from an external point to a circle are equal? Therefore, triangle AOS is congruent to triangle AOP by SSS congruency condition. Therefore, angle AOS, let us take this as angle 1, is equal to angle AOP, let us take this as angle 2. Similarly, we can say angle 3 is equal to angle 4. And angle 5 is equal to angle 6. And angle 7 is equal to angle 8. Now, angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 4 plus angle 5 plus angle 6 plus angle 7 plus angle 8 is equal to 360 degree angles at a point. Now this implies, now angle 1 is equal to angle 2. So we can write angle 1 plus angle 2 as twice angle 1 and twice angle 2. Similarly angle 3 is equal to angle 4. So we can write angle 3 plus angle 4 as twice angle 3 and twice angle 4. Again angle 5 is equal to angle 6. So we can write angle 5 plus angle 6 is equal to twice angle 5 and twice angle 6. And angle 7 is equal to angle 8. So we can write angle 7 plus angle 8 is equal to twice angle 7 and twice angle 8. So this implies twice angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 6 plus angle 7 is equal to 360 degree and twice angle 1 plus angle 4 plus angle 5 plus angle 8 is equal to 360 degree. This implies Angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 6 plus angle 7 is equal to 180 degree and angle 1 plus angle 4 plus angle 5 plus angle 8 is equal to 180 degree. Again we can write this as angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 6 plus angle 7 is equal to 180 degree and angle 1 plus angle 8 plus angle 4 plus angle 5 is equal to 180 degree. Now in the figure angle 2 plus angle 3 is angle AOB. And angle 6 plus angle 7 is angle COD. So this implies angle AOB plus angle COD is equal to 180 degree because angle 2 plus angle 3 is equal to angle AOB and 
एंगल सिक्स प्लस एंगल सेवन इज इक्वल टू एंगल सीओडी एंड नाउ एंगल वन प्लस एंगल एट इज एंगल एओडी एंड एंगल फोर प्लस फाइव इज एंगल बीओसी we have proved that the opposite sides of a quadrilateral circumscribing a circle subtend supplementary angles at the center of the circle that is angle aob plus angle cod is equal to 180 degree and angle aod plus angle boc is equal to 180 degree hence proved i hope the solution is clear to you bye and take care